All right, so we got Great Zone Warfare, 23 minutes of exclusive gameplay. Let's check it out. Let's see. I just want to give, uh, I want to um, give like my point of view on this uh, because I seen this and I was like, oh, you know, let me check this out. Let's see. I might not actually react to like the whole 23 minutes because I, I got like a lot of videos to do, y'all. But I will check this out. Raw gameplay footage. Who made this, by the way? They use an Unreal Engine 5. Okay, that's cool. Nice. This looks like a like a soldier type of game, like a like a like a, well, obviously it's a first person shooter. I don't know why, but I I get major major like Battlefield like vibes from this. I haven't played uh, bro Battlefield. In like 10 years, bro. This is like the Xbox 360 days, honestly. Y'all remember back then when, um, y'all remember back then when, when, uh, Battlefield was like a competitor for Call of Duty? That was a classic time. Yeah. Scenery looks nice. I'll be honest, it doesn't. It doesn't look bad. I like I like how the trees was like blowing, you know, because the helicopter was right next to them. I like that. Like I, I I like the small stuff, you know. Have you guys ever been in a uh, in a helicopter before? I've never been in a helicopter. Oh. Uh oh. Okay. Okay, so I don't know if it's if it's the gun, but like that looks a little hard to see. Maybe it's just the gun. Maybe it's just the gun. I like how open this is. Following uh, MFG Dave. Okay. I get like major like Escape from Terkov vibes from this as well. And Battlefield vibes. It's like a mix between those two games. So we'll see. I'm trying to see something go down. I'm trying to see like some shots fly or something, you know? In the game, of course, you know? <laughs> of course, like, you know. So let's see. So far, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't look bad at all. So I'm guessing like this is like one of like the missions, I guess. Is this like a, uh, this has to be like a story mode game, right? Yeah, like story mode game. This might be the uh, multiplayer, but I get like a major like, like campaign, like, you know, standard, like first person shooter, like, you know, soldier campaign. I get that vibe from this immediately. Okay, so it looks like they're, uh, they're going to like a, a specific spot or something like that. Again, you know, I, I might not actually have time to, like, react to the whole 23 minutes. But I just want to see it. Like, I, I might have to skip ahead a little bit just to see, like, you know, it's like some action. It, it, like, if any action. I'm going to give you, like, one or two more minutes. And then we'll we'll, um, we'll skip forward to see if there's, like, uh, okay, all right. It looks, it looks like they're about to start doing something. I think one of them just planted somewhere. Uh oh. I hear somebody. Where am I looking at? Oh, oh. Okay. Um, I I only have one problem. I only have one like one problem, and I, it maybe it's it's my eyesight. I think I have pretty good eyesight. I have twenty twenty vision. Um, that was a little hard to see. That water does look nice. I can't lie. A lot of like the okay. This is what I like. This is what I like. Okay, I can clearly see this. I can clearly see this. Um. So it was just that gun, basically. Um, 
a lot of the stuff like uh, like uh environment wise is really nice the water the plants the grass like the scenery everything looks nice this gun right here i i will never use i'm gonna be i'm gonna just be completely honest this gun is ugh. But the other gun with the with the zoom in scope, that was that was a gun that I most likely will use. Um, see, like this gun right here, I can definitely use this. I don't know if this is like a this look like a that looked like it was like a it was like a machine gun with a not machine gun, sorry. That looked like it was like a like a um like a gun with just like a it like zoomed in scope with it. And like, I listen, don't and listen. I'm not a gun like you know connoisseur, so don't ever take any gun advice from me. I don't want people to be like, oh, he thinks he knows what he's talking. Like, no, 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 no. I'm not a gun connoisseur at all. Like, you know, like I played Call of Duty for ten years, but like, I'm not like a you know a gun expert at all. Like, I've never claimed to be. Yeah, this gun. No, this. Oh no, I, I can't lie, bro. If I'm this guy, if I'm the soldier, I'm throwing this gun immediately and switching to the pistol. No, I can't, bro. This 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 gun, right? I, I, bro, I gotta like, bro, I gotta like play like, like like a Valorant player. You guys know how Valorant players and CS:GO players they gotta play with with, with the screen up to their face like these, bro. If I'm using that gun, bro, I gotta like put my eyes close to the screen. Okay, hold up. So whenever you take damage, oh, this is just like. Oh, so you actually bandage up as well. It's wait, so is that like a, a, a like a rifle? No, no shots. That's the sniper, right? So if you get hit, you have to like get in cover and like, you know, uh, like heal yourself. That's that's different. Okay, that's like some uh, escape from Turkov stuff. Here's the thing, right? I'm so used to playing like fast paced, like Call of Duty and stuff like that, like my whole life, that I like I most likely have to like get used to this. I'm definitely gonna have to get used to like, you know, shooting, whatever, and then if I take a little damage, I have to, you know, go behind something and bandage up. I gotta definitely get used to that because uh I'm definitely, you know, used to the whole like fast pace. Um, you know, if I take a little damage, I can just get behind a wall or whatever. And then my health can regenerate, and then I can come back out. Because I'm definitely, like, a fast-paced uh, type of player, you know. Um, but, like, the whole, you know, take a little damage, and I got to bandage up. and I'm not really used to that. But, I mean, but I can make do, though. Okay. Here's what I'll say. The, that's, that rifle, that sniper rifle, that might be the best gun in the game so far that I've seen. Cause I, I couldn't use this gun right here. This this gun is it, it's very weird. Like the aiming's weird. Like I don't know if you can like you know like replace like a um. I don't know. Okay. All right, I'm gonna do one more minute and then I'm I'm gonna wrap it up. And then we give like my 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 closer to the, to the thing. I mean I'm gonna let me skip forward. Let me see. All right. Okay. Let me. Then the helicopter's coming. Okay. Okay. All right. Here, here's what I say about this, right? Gray zone warfare. Okay. Um. Here's here's what I like about it. I like the. I, I like. I like the scenery. I like the graphics. I like uh, a lot of like the environments, like like the uh, grass and 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 and. Um, even the guns, I like the way the gun looks. I like how the game looks just in general. I like that a lot. Um, I'll probably say like a bad thing or not a bad thing, but just like a thing for me. That's like, you know, just, just making me like scratch my chin, um, is like the guns. Some of the guns are very, um, I don't know. It's very weird. Like the one gun with the, with, with, let me see, let me show you like this gun right here. Um, like whenever you aim in, it's kind of like I'm, I'm aiming in, I'm looking like through the scope like this and like, I'm just shooting whatever. Um, so that gun is definitely a, a big no-no for me. Um, the sniper rifle, that looks pretty cool. 
Um, and I really have no other, like, it, it, you know, this game isn't out yet. It's like raw footage. So I respect them, you know, for, for them even like putting it out. Um, so I would probably say that everything else looks really nice. Like the scenery, the graphics, you really did good on that one. But the gun, I don't know, bro. That gun is ugly. I, I, and, you know, listen, maybe, you know, we can, like, switch attachments, whatever. That would be pretty cool. If you don't have that in your game, make sure you put that in the game. Like, you can switch off attachments and stuff like that. But I recommend you. I mean, you already, you probably already have it. Like, why am I telling you that? You probably already have it. Other than that, man, comment down below. What do you guys think? I, I really want to get you guys' opinion on this. What do you guys think of Gray Zone Warfare? Do you guys have anything? I'm out. And...